word. I want to uh, like switch it up a bit. Switch it up because of the Olympics are uh, are uh, are around. Yeah. Um, I want to talk about a few topics. Yeah. About Ooh. the thing. I want to talk about this. Um, Emma, can you uh, read this out? Uh, when I bring it up. Uh, it's the concerning the female athletes. Mm. Um, Is this the volleyball? The volleyball, and also, um, so we'll go. We'll go with the volleyball first. Em, you want to read this? A women's handball team wore shorts instead of skimpy bikini bottom oh. uniforms. The league fined them over one thousand seven hundred dollars. Are you serious? You That's re- the one I meant. Sorry, not volleyball. The handball. Wait, the handball. but their shorts are just like cycling shorts. They're I mean, not like they're pretty skimpy. They're pretty revealing. That's... Why would they be fined? Okay, so I think, yeah, go on, go on. Go That's go. a bit sexist. It is a bit sexist. So when the Norwegian women's beach handball team walked onto the court, beach handball, um, to face Spain, the players chose not to wear the bikinis and wore uh, wore basically form fitting blue athletic shorts. Right. So they had that. That was that point of view, right? And then this article uh, came up. Huh. Is this at the same Olympics? I don't know if it's at the same. She's um Paralympian. Paralympian Olivia Breen oh, yes. dismayed after being told sprint briefs are too short. Oh. Yeah. So. Yeah. What were you saying, Alexander? No, I just, I've seen. Both of these things I was going to bring to the table. So, uh, oh, there you go. Yes. That's wild. <laughs> one of the uh, wild. one of my favorite quotes from this is, I'll just read this excerpt. When asked about the rationale behind the requirement that female players wear bikini bottoms, a spokeswoman for the International Handball Federation said, "We're looking into it." So they don't even have a reason for it. No, and They've yet they'll still and find, find them. them. Before having a reason. You cannot tell me it's because people want to watch the women. You know, that's why they, they tune in to watch the women in briefs. In the oh, bottom. 100% is why that was a rule. <laughs> like, not yeah. even, that not being facetious, not joking. That 100% boil. is the exact, they, when they put that rule in place, went, more men will watch it if we make them wear these. Yeah. Yeah. Why do you, like, do you yeah. remember, I don't even know if it's still a thing, it might be, lingerie football, American football. I think oh, it's still yes! a thing. Yeah, it's still a thing. Still no, a thing. it's not. Yeah. It is. No, it's not. The, the, it is still a thing. There's lingerie basketball. I I didn't even know, I, I, I don't know why it came, like, I don't know, I think my friend showed me or sent me the link, I don't know how it, I don't, I don't know, know how, how I started, how it got it, it, I don't know how I started watching it, 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 it but, uh, isn't, isn't that what, what you showed me, Ronnie? Is <laughs> oh, that why you quickly you said, put your phone you said, away when I came in? You said in. you found this online, you said you found this online, Sage, <laughs> and have a look, Oh, really tall girls in lingerie, I was oh, it like, wasn't, damn dude, how'd you see this? It wasn't me. You said you, you're a fan. <laughs> oh, you didn't send it to me. I sent it to you. Um, oh, so when I saw that, I was like, it's really like weird. the lingerie basketball. They, they were wearing thongs. Some of these girls were wearing thongs. They Where do even, they play this? I don't think, I don't know how big it is. I don't know. I think they were just trying to, I don't know what they were doing actually. But I, I, yeah. I think I've seen the same thing you're talking about. I think it was more of a proposition than an actual right. league that they yeah. created. And I think it was also used against the WNBA as like there are several people suggesting this is what they should do if they want more fans. Oh, right. I don't think they should do that. No. It's, no. It, it was the, I don't understand. <laughs> it was a horrible game. <laughs> I didn't watch the whole game, but I didn't watch the whole game. Um, <laughs> anyways, back to these athletes. Uh, what do you think about a para- Paralympian, Olivia Brin? being told to like the short are too short and then it's it's just all disgraceful i don't understand i don't i i, I the one with the too short i looked at as a headline and intrigue because of this handball one that mm. came out at the same time the yeah. one with the paralympian again i'm not i'm not actually sure when this story broke because it's not the paralympics right now i don't no. know if no. she's a paralympian and they were just defining her as that but she was another event or whatever yeah but i will say 
if they ever want to put in rules of there is something that's too revealing, I'm more okay with that in the sense of there has to be limits when it comes mm-hmm. to co- like someone can't show up naked. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like there has to be limits mm-hmm. and you have to define that. So mm-hmm. at some point, something would be too revealing. I, again, I'm no, not saying 100%. hers works. I haven't seen hers. I don't know. A hundred percent. It's just the other the, way around. Yeah. It's how can you say on one hand this and then on the other hand this? Like, I don't understand. Yeah. Go figure. Like, it's just what, what benefit? does it have to anyone if the athletes I mean do you know what's interesting as well I didn't look did they win who don't know the girls the handball team because then can then like they can even go you know obviously it doesn't affect performance either like obviously we know this anyway but just as more of a slap in the face of what they're doing actually no I don't know if they won the B-side word 